And new at 5 o'clock, you could soon be charged for every mile you drive because that proposal is being considered right now by California lawmakers. And we sent 10 News reporter Craig Herrera to find out how it would work and what your money would pay for. Yeah, well, the hope here is to generate $60 billion in the next 20 years. Now, of course, the question is, how do we do that? Well, some say the answer is to keep tabs on your trip. Harlan German drives a moving truck for a living. A big trip for me would oh, be over like 200 to 300 something miles. When he's behind the wheel, those miles can quickly add up. Well, I'm on the road and I'm going a lot of miles. And now we gotta pay for the miles that we're going? Maybe. It's part of a pilot program starting later this year in California. Generally speaking, people see this as a user paid approach. They're used to it already with their cell phone bills, their cable TV, you pay for what you use. More fuel efficient cars means drivers are pumping less gas. That means less money coming in from the gas sales tax. And now the state is hoping paying a charge for every mile driven will make up for the loss in revenue to help build and maintain public roads. And so if you don't go that far, then you won't spend so much money. Last month, thousands of Oregon drivers started testing mileage-based taxes. This photo released by the Oregon Department of Transportation shows a display device on the dashboard. It shows how many and what kind of miles a driver has driven. But in California, they're not sure how to track your mileage. Something as simple as buying almost like a scratcher ticket, in the, you know, when you buy a lotto ticket, stick it on your bumper or put it in your windshield. And that would give you so many months of driving time. And of course, the state can also track you based on the technology already in the car. Here you can track the, your trip history, several trips and trip odometer. Now, 5,000 drivers from around the state will be recruited for this pilot program. They'll track their mileage for one full year. The pay by mile system, of course, would get rid of that gas sales tax. Live in Central San Diego, Craig Herrera, 10 News. Trying to find answers, Craig. Uh, how do you want to see the road improvements paid for? According to a 10 News Union Tribune poll, 6% said tax the drivers who drive in the left lane. 9% said tax people based on how many miles they drive. 10% said tolls on our freeways. 15% said taxing people based on how much gas they buy. And 56% said another approach.